Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Weekly videos are uploaded, so don't be shy. Hit that subscribe button and turn that notification bell on so you don't miss out on any of my Tuesday tips. So, in today's video, I will be showing you guys how to put medication inside of your solution bag such as a peritonitis kit or heparin. So, keep on watching. First, you need to check that the bag is clear. You also need to check the dextrose is correct, not expired, and the correct volume. Then you're going to give it a firm squeeze. If there are no leaks, you're good to go. Now, grab the heating pad and place the manual bag inside without the draining bag. That way, it only heats up the manual. Now, grab some disinfecting wipes. I just use Clorox wipes. And you remember, you always have to disinfect your area and keep it clean. So now we're going to grab our heated manual bag, a couple of syringes, maybe three just in case, your needles, povidone iodine prep pads, your antibiotics or heparin, mask and hand sanitizer. Now put your mask on and get ready to wash your hands. Hands have hidden spots where bacteria lives, so rub in between all of your fingers, your knuckles, and the back of your hand. Turn off the water with your elbow. I prefer using napkins to paper towels because they're just easier to grab. All clean spirit fingers. And as usual, hand sanitizer. We're going to flip the manual over to where you have a clear way to the medication port. Now, grab the prep pad. So, I have a little trick. I open the pad as wide as I can, wrap the medication port with the Pavadine pad, then I just snuggle this baby right back on. The second Pavadine pad will be used on the vial. And now we wait. Grab a syringe and a needle. We're going to open the needle first and hold the open side of the needle out. Place your thumb on the upper indent of the syringe to open it with ease. With your other hand, squeeze the tip of your syringe to twist off the extra tip. Now twist and screw on the needle. Ta-da! Grab the medication port and insert the needle. My clinic advises me to take 7 cc's from the bag. Make sure to follow your clinic's guidelines. You want to insert the needle as close to the middle of the top of the vial as possible. Make sure the vial is completely set on the table before you insert the needle. Don't shake the vial. Roll the vial in between your hands. Or you can twist it in one hand. There is still some foam so I will still need to twist it. Awesome, now we're good to go. So we're going to flip the syringe and push the air back into the vial. Now this is where you have to act fast because there is a lot of pressure inside the vial. So try to pull the needle all the way to the end of the vial and tilt it to the side. Now release your thumb. There will be some air in your needle, so slowly push the air out. Insert the needle 
back into the medicine port and inject the medication into the solution bag. Make sure you are disposing of your needles properly. Now we're going to move the bag around to evenly distribute the medicine. And that's how you put medication in your manual bag. From here, continue your regular dialysis treatment. Thanks for watching my video. I hope I was able to teach you guys something. If you have any questions, leave your comments below. I will try my very best to answer them. I hope to see you here next week for Tuesday Tips. Man, I'm so ready for these tacos. Bye!